Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ariel, and today we're going to be doing a mask time. And as you can see. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ariel and today we're going to be doing the mask time and the mask of choice is this little aloe mask. Oh, it, okay. Phones fucking focusing and shit. Alright, so this is the aloe mask. We're going to put it on and we're going to talk about a topic. Why? Hey, while you're at it, show them your fucking nipples. Shut up! Did you, did you wipe like, the rest of it on the inside on your um, face? What do you mean? Because is there essence on the inside of it? No, 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 <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Oh, look. Oh, this is a long nose piece. That's the first. No, we're too small. Oh, well. You're going to cover. First of all, fuck you. To be fucking funny. You deserve it. Hey, give it home. Do I have my yeah, yes, ma'am. Can you put your camera on it? Where? Uh... Where is it? Where is it? The face shop. Please, the fancy. 15 minutes. Well, you actually... Alright, so we're back. This is on my left. Alright. Mm. Alright, so we're back. So, today we're gonna talk about... Males and their, like, sensitive masculinity. Um... I'm gonna talk a bit differently, because I'm trying to keep this on my lip. Anyway. So... I don't understand why guys are so sensitive on their masculinity but they are um just nobody wants to like no guy wants to be seen as like feminine or anything which i guess kind of tails into why some guys don't date trans girls i guess because they're like people's gonna judge them or some bullshit i don't i, I don't i don't know i don't care well no i care but like I don't, I don't care as much as they think I do. Um, alright, there we go. But yeah, so guys don't really date trans girls because they're like all sensitive of their masculinity, which I don't think dating a trans person would necessarily like threaten your masculinity or anything, but some people are just like, uh, you know, it's still a guy at the end of the day or something. Or some random bullshit that doesn't need to be said out of their mouth. Because any any trans girl I know is like hyper effeminated, if that makes any any sense. Um, and I think trans trans girls have this whole thing with being hyper effemin effeminated because they're trying to make themselves look more feminine. Um, because they're trans. So I don't really see how people are like is, is attacking their masculinity or anything because I just don't get it. Um, but I also get why because in society like people are all about you know how everything is either like this or that and so people don't really get why somebody would date a trans person because everybody's like oh well you know. What does it have between his legs? Because, you know, they don't use pronouns. They always refer to, you know, as it, it. <laughs> Rude asses. Um, and then based on that, they'll make a judgment about everything else, which is completely and entirely rude in itself. So, probably shouldn't be talking with this on my mouth. But we just gonna roll with it. So, but yeah. Um, that also brings me to the point of why I try to date straight guys. <laughs> Keyword there is try because a bitch is single as a motherfucker. Um, but I date them because they only date girls. Women. Whatever you want to call them. Females of the female nature. 
And so I want to be seen as a female, so I date people who only date females, if that makes any sense. No. Why does it not make sense? I don't know. I didn't get the thought. I just wanted to say no. Why'd you... You fucking thought... But yeah. And according to Jared, you know, straight guys who do anything with trans girls are technically gay. Well, he's still has a dick. Yes. And this is why we have this conversation now. Because people need to change their way of thinking. What do you mean? You need... Because it's not about what I have. It's just about... The long run and me trying to be seen as a female and everything. Lord Jesus. Yeah. They don't do anything with the dick, boy. That's like saying they can have sex with me, but they're still straight if I just say I'm a trick during it. But you're not! And you're not even trans! That doesn't matter because he's still got a dick. Doesn't matter because I don't fucking use the shit. Yes, he does. He's still got a penis. I don't. You, you know what? In order to fuck you, they have to go through the hole, not the vagina. You know what? Once you get a vagina, you can call yourself Nikita 2.0. And then... <laughs> Unnecessary shade. Don't even get fucking... Oh, I don't want the Nikita clan on oh, my goddamn thing. Don't do it. What do you mean? We love a queen. Are you going to James Charles? I love Nikita. I love Nikita and her, you know, body. But... Just you now you see what I'm dealing with. Like this is why we're having these conversations now. Like people have, you know, that that thought might be a little bit wrong, but you know they still have it. And I'm not gonna sit here and argue day and night about it. They can do whatever the fuck they want. I've literally patted this shit like eighteen thousand times. Male male sensitivity literally stems from like everybody trying to be hyper masculine, along with females trying to be hyper effeminated. And it's all because everybody wants to be a stereotypical straight or straight person or whatever. So yes, like, get into it. Go dive deep. Yes, shut uh, up. You're diving deep. I'm proud of go. This bitch tells me to like fucking do something and then talks while I do it. He's so fucking rude. Oh, boo boo. But anyway, so what I'm doing is I took literally the excess from like the package and put it on there so I get like all the essence and the juices and whatnot. If anybody's wondering why the fuck I'm smacking my face with my hand. Well, I smack my face with my hand too. That's because you like masochism. I'm like, you're a dumb bitch, you're a dumb bitch, and I just, I just keep punching him. And I don't stop. Can you shut up? Lord. But yeah, so people want to be like all super, like, females want to be super feminated. And I know this isn't for everybody, because some people just don't care about being cookie cutter and like all that stuff. And I understand that. But I'm just speaking for like the vast majority. Um, this is also why guys have such a problem with gay people because they're all like, uh, you know, you're not super masculine, even though a lot of masculine guys are gay, or there are masculine gay guys, and the majority of them have, you know, the typical straight friends because then they're like, oh, you know, you're not like every every other, you know, gay guy or whatever. Like, I I don't know, but. Wow. That's how that goes. Wow. What? Um, I don't know how straight people, straight guys talk. That was just awful. <laughs> Why? That was just. That was just. Awful. You told me to do voices. I did voices. Stop it. Bit, no. no <laughs> that. Stop! I can't laugh. When I, had voices, I, I didn't mean literally make them sound like they're autistic. <laughs> And there's nothing wrong with autistic people. Except they're autistic. Jared! <laughs> You're going to hell. You don't need to say there's nothing wrong with autistic people. Everyone knows there's nothing wrong with autistic people. There isn't. Exactly. You don't need to say you don't need to state it in the video. I don't want them to think I have a problem with autistic people. And besides, if it does, they get mad at you, they come to your channel, they give you clout, other people like you, there you go. Ew! You made me sound like a clout chaser! AJ, hmm? you're on YouTube, you are a clout chaser. Mm-hmm. Anyway. AJ's like, I'm perfect and content with my 200 views. I'm content with whatever the fuck I get. Oh, you'll get a lot more than that, buddy. Uh-huh. Kiki. Hiya. Huh? <laughs>
Anyway. <laughs> but I think that also stems into why guys have problems with dating trans girls because they have the mentality of Jared over here. They're like, oh, it's still a guy, this, that, the third. Don't you fucking say it while I'm talking. I didn't say still a guy. I said still a dick. Yeah, which in turn makes it sound like I'm still a dick. Yeah, but it's the male genitalia. It does not match her because I'm not trying to keep it. Yeah, I know that. Those are also expensive. And we're not going to have this conversation about vaginas. That would be an interesting conversation. Then I'll make it for another video. Just do it this No! Uh, Why not? Because it's not on fucking topic. Yeah, like none of your video has. Shut up. Keep it truthful. My videos have somewhat of a topic, you rude twat of a person. Do they though? Yes. I'm not doing this with a sheet mask no more. Like, never again am I doing a sheet mask for this, for these videos. I don't think you're supposed to do a sheet mask. You're supposed to do a mask. But... Yeah, but not a sheet mask. I know. I'm probably going to do it though. Be a part sheet. Shut up, boy. I know, you're making my come up. You're making me talk. You won't shut the fuck up! <laughs> yeah, because I'm making your video... You're making it so I look like. You're making everybody see your true colors of being a twat. You act like I hide them. You, you try to. No, I don't. Uh huh. Huh? Yeah, you do. But I literally met someone and called him a bitch. <laughs> That's typical, Jerry. <laughs> like, I'm confused. What do you mean, what am I hiding? Anyway. But yeah, so guys are having masks on it, which is why they try. They don't date trans women, even though a lot of them find trans women attractive. But then that stems into the whole thing of trans women's are fantasies and experiments and shit that I don't condone um, at all because it's disrespectful. And I'm not here for it. And if you ever in your life say I'm an experiment or a fantasy, the chances of you talking to me have drastically dropped again. If you fucking call me an experiment after this video, Jared, I will end you. I'm not gonna call you an experiment. I don't know, because you like to do stupid shit like that. Like calling you an experiment? No, just call me names in general. Well, yeah, it's easy to joke. Yeah, y'all see what I deal with. Jared's not the nicest person. JK! <laughs> I hate you. God damn it. But anyway, it's been 15 minutes, so we're gonna head and snatch these bad boys off. Because I'm not my face. Ooh, look at that shine. Ooh, girl, you got a glow going. Uh, you can keep yours on for another five minutes. Too bad, Tammy, you got going through. Hey, I'm gonna pick it up. Hey. Yes, I was. Just like you were gonna pick up your burrito. I thought I was gonna eat my burrito. Yeah, where's your burrito? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> it's still where it was Check when we started. <laughs> but yeah, so that's the whole thing with hyper masking only. Oh my god, I feel so much better after that mask. <laughs> oh my god, you didn't go into detail. Can you let me fucking finish? Because you're wrapping up the video. Yeah, and I'm about to fucking go back through it. For people who just skip to the end of the videos, because the people who do that shit. So. If you didn't feel like sticking around for the whole video, here's the synopsis of what we went over. Guys are hypermasculine. Hypermasculine. Masculated. Is that even a word? I don't I don't think it's a word. But guys are hypermasculine, and that's why they don't date trans women because they feel like dating them is like dating a guy and they don't want to seem feminine because dating a guy makes them gay and gay people to seem as feminine. I don't it, that that whole sh straight straight people shit. Um and then girls, girls actually date more trans people than guys do, though. In my, in, in my opinion. Like, I've seen some, some trans guys become lesbian, and they just date girls, and it's just that. No, some trans girls become lesbian. Well, I've I was seen... going to say, why do trans guys just become straight? <laughs> Shut up. I know, I thought about that. I was like, why do I say guys? Some trans girls um, date women, um, be, and they're, they're perfectly fine. And, um, like, it's just, I don't know. So, 
I don't, I don't know about the whole trans women and dating female thingy because I, I, I haven't dated females in a long ass time, if ever. So, I know about trans women and dating straight guys and guys in general who are not dating them. Do you say dating straight guys? Yeah. Why? What is the problem with me saying dating straight guys, Jared? Go ahead and say it. Prove my point, Jared. Because we were like, I don't know. Because girls will date straight guys, and it's like, no shit, they will. <laughs> I said trans. I said I know about trans girls and dating straight guys. Fuck. Wow. There you go. That's what I said. No, I don't think that is, is it? Yes. Yeah, oh, I said I don't know about. I'm about to say I don't know about trans girls and dating girls. I know more about trans girls and dating guys. And straight guys and bi guys and stuff like that. I do not. I personally do not try to date gay guys because there's no point at all. Because I'm getting, like, the thing they don't want. <laughs> and they get really upset when I tell them I'm getting the thing that you they don't want. Still got a hole. Stop fucking talking. <laughs> what? Stop fucking talking. What? Shut up. Was that a wrong statement, though? Yes. No, it wasn't. Shut the fuck up. I have plenty of you guys feeling like holes in my Shut up! Uh, but then again, those are download guys. The ones who let you blow them in your cul de sac at night. Oh my god, the download guys are technically the straight guys. They're like, no homo. Dude, the download guys fucking piss me off. They're like, I'm down low, though. It's like. I think they make everybody mad. And like, across the board, download guys well, are known yeah, to be very vexing. Like, I'm Grindr. And it's like, I'm not meeting up with you. I don't know what you look like. Just trust me, bro. No, you're gonna rape me. <laughs> I mean, that's what you want. <laughs> yeah, if it's Tom Holland. Ugh. <laughs> Or Emma Stone. Or literally and anyone else. <laughs> but him. But them, yeah, exactly. Because they're also most of the time fucking ugly as shit, too. I like how he's talking all this shit off camera and won't get in front of his camera for nothing. I don't want to uproot you. Uproot me? What does that even mean? I meant to say upstage you, but I'm just so far ahead of you that I didn't know how to lower my own speed on Ooh. This bitch thinks he is so fucking smart and so with his words because the bitch damn sure can't fucking form no English any other fucking time and he want to be so high right now. And bitch I tried bitch. it. Hell yes I do. Who you do you room you in? Stop talking to me right now. Shut the You're fuck up. Because somebody's like, oh my god, when are you going to come over to watch me play video games? And I was like, I'll do it today. Yeah, but then you gotta switch. Yeah, because I'm waiting on my phone to charge. So I don't record my videos. videos. <laughs> so <don't> record <laughs> <laughs> That's I could have told you that you didn't ask. You never asked me questions until Actually, after the I'm fact. I'm relatively sure it's still because there's an HDMI port for that and for this. There's a Dubai HDMI? Mm -hmm. Then go ahead, try it. Yeah, I will a little bit. But that extra high resolution will kick your ass. Kick your ass. No, I've already concluded the fact that your monitor is 10 years better than me. If you kick it, can you make sure you like do it nicely? Can I sit, call you Rihanna and you just call me Chris Brown? No, you cannot. Uh uh. No. Amber no. Heard no. What? I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. But yeah, so, and then, I mean, I don't uh, know. I forgot what we're talking about for a second. Oh, 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 oh. Um, it's male sensitivity and then a little masculine shit, 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 shit. Guys. Yeah. So, guys, fuck your sensitive masculinity, in my yes. opinion. Fuck it. Yes, you just got it. Yes, you did it. You, did, you, you just cured hypermasculinity. This is why I, I told this bitch when we started to shut the fuck up. And he and just has it. Shut the fuck up. No, you. <laughs> and then you just talk at the end of all of my shit. Yeah. Ugh. Gotta keep them attention somehow. I want this off my face. Okay. I told you you could take it off. You could have been taking it off. It's been that. After it was 10 minutes, you could take it off. It was 10 to 15. Mine's 20. Oh, bitch. Can't do it. Now I normally like my head. My headband that no. I use for washing my face. It's cute. It has a little bow. Oh, sure. It's cuter than Jared. That ain't hard. Amy here. So, when was the last time you were in a relationship? So. That is so rude. So what? I haven't been in a relationship since my last ex about six years ago. Uh huh. You're disrespectful. No, I'm not. And that was unnecessary. No, I'm not. You just called me ugly, bitch. Fuck you. We all know I'm sick. I mean, okay. Hey. Some people are known to call you a goblin. 
Yeah, literally the most pretentious boy on the face of the fucking planet. <laughs> <laughs> if he ever watches this video, he's gonna be really actually What's he gonna do? I know, right? Share your bean! <laughs> What the fuck ever, that long complicated ass fucking topic. Um, um, it's not even, it's, it's that hyper masculinity in males and their sensitivity to it because everybody wants to be all macho man. It's literally what I just said, bitch. Shut the whole fuck up. It makes sense, bitch. I will throw my head in, but I feel like you would keep it. I would. I know, that's why I'm not gonna do it. It's my mission in life to draw weekends in the trash. He's so rude. But anyway. Am I though? Um, I don't like the hyper masculine men, even though I like the, the ones that look super masculine and aggressive. It makes no sense. <coughs> but I don't like the. We're not gonna talk about her, okay? <laughs> anyway, so let me get off this thing before Jared makes any more um, intrusive ass comments. Don't you fucking say shit. I'll anyway, so I will see y'all in my next one. Bye. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to click that subscribe button, that like button, hit that bell for notifications. You so said I'm, it. <laughs> I'm gonna say it fucking again because I want y'all to do it. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah, I know. Come on here and join this team. Jerry can shut the fuck up. What is your team name? I don't have one. <laughs> I got one. No. No, Jared is not allowed to make a team name. What do you mean? You're not allowed to make a team name because it's either something very disrespectful to me. Yes, because you do shit like that. I wasn't going to do anything. Just let me look up that chick from Star Wars. Who? If you call me a fucking Tweelink, bitch, I'm going to kick your ass. A what? A Tweelink. Mm. Yeah, it's some things with all the little dread thingies, the little tubes on her head. It's T-W-I... Don't worry, correct you the corner. Fucking dumbass. But yeah, so come join the team. And but I'm gonna get off of this camera because I've been ranting for like the last couple minutes. Bye.